that I can ask for. Mm -hmm. My baby, he's all right. Hello, namaste and peace and blessings. Thank you so much for joining me here this evening in our yoga flow. I ask that you find yourself in a comfortable seated position. Maybe a lotus, half lotus. I am sitting in a cow face. May you find your seat. Any pose that feels comfortable for you. Bringing our palms together at heart center. Gazing downward towards the earth. Noticing how our bodies feel as we inhale. Hold the breath. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale. Noticing how the breath relaxes and soothes the mind and body. Maybe you notice how your shoulders relax downward away from your ears with each exhale. Inhale. Exhale. As we continue to gaze downward, using the breath and the down gaze to help us go inward here today. Taking a couple moments of silence to help us feel centered. Bringing attention to our present moment with our silence and down gaze. Continuing with our prayer hands. Relaxing our shoulders downward. Shoulders are nice and tall. Spinal cord is nice and long. Our tummy is tucked. Breathe in. Breathe out. Gazing downward. As our hands flow to the sides of our bodies, palms facing downward, feeling the energies of the universe, feeling the energies of our environment. As we go inward here today, focusing on our present moment. Inhale. and how this feels. Bringing our palms together above our heads, seated salute. Tummy's nice and tight. Maybe bringing our palms together. Exhaling down, seated prayer. Nice, slow movements. We are not in a rush here. Thanking ourselves for allowing ourselves to practice self-care here today. This is our time. Thus we will move in nice slow motions if we choose. We don't have any need to rush here. This is our time. Self-care is a necessity. Inhale, exhale, palms above the head, seated salute, exhale, seated prayer, allowing our palms to fall beside our bodies, palms facing downward, as we lean our bodies towards the right, 
allowing our left arm to go up in the air above our heads as we bend our bodies to our side bend. Noticing how this feels. Going down as deep as we comfortably can. We're gonna hold this pose for four breaths. Exhaling back to center, palms down on the earth. Left, right arm goes up in the air as our bodies lean towards the left. Feeling the side bend, going downward as comfortably as we can. Noticing how we feel. We're gonna hold this pose for four breaths. Exhaling back up to center, palms are on the earth. Relaxing, inhale. Exhale, finding our minds and bodies completely relaxed. Noticing how the breath relaxes. Noticing how the down gaze helps us become centered and focused here on our present moment. Being aware of the here and the now. Breathing our palms at heart center, seated prayer. Inhale. Exhale. Breathing our bodies to our seated twist right side. Right arm goes behind our backs as we slightly gaze over that right shoulder. Noticing how our spinal cords relax and decompress. We're going to hold this pose for four to five breaths. Exhaling back to center. Seated twist opposite side. Right hand goes over to the left. Left hand goes behind the back. We're gonna gaze over our left shoulder and hold this pose for four breaths, relaxing our mind and bodies here. Breathing back to center. Exhale. Seated salute, palms above the head. Shoulders are up, arms are up nice and tall, feeling a stretch here. Bodies are becoming nice and long. Exhale down, seated prayer, palms together. Gazing downward towards the earth. Inhale. Exhale. Flowing our bodies to our tabletop. We are on our hands and our knees. Our hands are beneath our shoulders. Our knees are hip distance apart. Dropping our bodies down to our cow. Tummy goes downward towards the earth. Chin goes slightly up. Slight back bend here, noticing how this feels. Relax in the body, hold in the pose, natural breaths. Exhale into cow, chin comes towards our clavicle, spinal cord comes upwards in the air. Hold in this pose. Exhaling back to our cow. Nice, natural breaths. We're gonna do a couple of cat-cow rotations Noticing how it feels within our bodies. Breathing and rotating in our natural breaths. Going with the flow, listening to our bodies here. Cat cow rotations. Exhale. 
as we breathe back to center checking in flowing into our bird pose right side right leg goes out to the back nice and tall we can always do an option of lowering our right foot downward towards the earth if that feels best for us or we can keep our leg in the air whatever feels good completing our bird pose we're going to allow our left hand to come forward gazing downward tummy is nice and tight feeling our body's balance and strength in here we are going to hold our bird pose for four breaths Breathe in, knee to elbow, feeling a crunch. Back to bird pose. Knee to elbow. Back to bird. Knee to elbow. Back to our bird. Flow into our table. Noticing how we feel. Dropping down to our cow. Exhale into our cat. Come into our table. Bird pose opposite side. Left leg goes towards the back. Or we can option out, lowering down our feet, whatever feels best for us. Bringing our right arm forward, gazing downward, tummy's nice and tight. Feeling our body's balance and strength in here. Holding a pose for natural breaths. Two more breaths. Exhale, knee to elbow, feeling the crunch. Back to bird. Knee to elbow, back to bird. Knee to elbow, back to bird. Flowing down to our table. Drop into our cow. Exhale into our cat. Flowing our bodies back to our hero's pose. Our buttocks goes towards the heels of our feet. Noticing how this feels. Palms go above our head. Salute. Exhale to prayer. Coming up to our knees in our kneel position. Noticing how we feel. Inhale. Exhale. Allowing our hands to go to the lower parts of our back. We are going to work on a camel, but before we go into camel, maybe we can do a couple of shoulder rotations. Lifting our shoulders up in the air towards our ears, rotating them towards the back. Shoulders up towards the ears, rotating them towards the back. We're doing a couple of shoulder rolls here. Simply loosening up our upper bodies and our shoulders, noticing how this feels in our bodies. Being aware, without judgment, simply noticing, finding pause. And if we feel well and good, maybe we can allow our shoulders and head to go back as our chest comes forward as we flow our bodies into our camel. Noticing how this feels in our back. We're going to hold this pose four to five breaths. Exhaling back to center. Maybe we can go deeper in our camel by allowing our hands to relax on our heels of our feet. Or we can allow our hands to interlace behind our backs, bounding, bounding our hands behind our backs. Whatever feels good for you. Or we can keep our hands at our lower backs. We're going to do one more camel pose. And a pose that feels best for us. We're going to hold this pose five breaths. Exhale back to our camel.
coming back up. Exhaling our bodies down. Buttocks comes towards our heels. We are back in our hero's pose. Breathing down to our wide mega child's pose for our puppy pose. Hands and palms go forward. Noticing how this feels. We're gonna hold this pose for six natural breaths. Gazing forward in our puppy pose or child's pose. Maybe we can rock our bodies from left to right, noticing how this feels. Hanging out here for a couple natural breaths. Hmm. Finding pause as we do a couple of spinal waves. Noticing how this feels in our spinal cord. Two more natural breaths, the spinal waves. Coming to our table. Coming back to our hero's pose. Hanging out here. Noticing how this feels in our body. Three natural breaths. Exhaling back down to our child's pose. Waving our bodies back to our table. Thread the needle right side. Right arm comes out to the side. Noticing how this feels. Tummy is nice and tight. Threading that right arm through the left. Buttocks is in the air nice and high. Relaxing our heads downward. Noticing how this feels. Nice natural breaths here. We can always go deeper in our thread the needle by lifting our left arm up in the air and wrapping it around our backs. If we choose, we're gonna hang out here for six natural breaths. Slowly unwrapping that arm, pushing our bodies up from our thread and needle, coming back to our table, dropping down to our cow, exhaling to our cat. Back to our table, thread the needle opposite side, left arm goes to the side, threading that arm through the right, body comes downward. Relaxing and hanging out here. And remember, we can always go deeper in our thread the needle by lifting our right arm and wrapping it around our backs. Whatever feels good for us. We're going to hold our thread the needle for six natural breaths. Unwrapping our arm, unthreading the needle, finding ourselves back in our table, dropping our bodies down to our cow, exhale to our cat, breathing to our table, pushing our bodies up, first down dog. Gazing back at our feet, tummy is nice and tight, ensuring that we are not downward but actually upwards we want to have our arms nice and strong here holding our bodies up in our down dog building strength tummies nice and tight holding this pose three more breaths breathe up dog flowing our bodies down dog up dog rotations Breathe back, down dog. <sighs> Breathe, up dog. 
Exhale, down dog. Flowing our bodies to our high plank, building strength, holding this pose, three breaths. Exhale, side plank. Either side, lifting our arm up in the air. Two breaths. Exhale, down dog. High plank. Side plank, opposite side. Arms up in the air. Exhale, down dog. Gazing back at our feet, gazing forward at our hands. Breathe, up dog, building strength. Exhale, down, cobra. Ensuring that our shoulders are away from our ears, not up, but downward, away. Holding this pose, feeling the back bend. Exhale, wide-legged child's pose. Holding this pose for six breaths. We're gonna hang out in our child's pose here. Building our strength, catching our breath. Four more breaths here. Two more breaths. Gazing forward, rocking our bodies from left to right. Walking our fingers to the fronts of our yoga mats, feeling a stretch. Waving our bodies, doing a couple of spinal waves from a low position, noticing how this feels within our spinal cord. Relaxing our spinal cords here. Decompressing. Exhale, table, flow into down dog. Gazing up, up dog, down dog. Breathing our bodies to our one-legged dog or three-legged dog, right side, right legs in the air, nice and high. Gazing back at our feet, feeling a stretch. Right knee, right elbow, feeling a crunch. Back to three-legged dog. Right knee, right elbow. Three-legged dog. Right knee, right elbow. Hold the pose, two breaths. Three-legged dog. <sighs> Exhale, down dog. Breathe, up dog. Exhale, down dog, building strength. Maybe we can pedal our feet, walking our dog, noticing how this feels in our hamstrings. We're gonna do this for a couple breaths. Coming up to our up dog. Breathe, down dog. Three-legged dog, opposite side. Left leg's in the air, nice and high. Gazing back at our feet. Left knee, left elbow. Feeling the crunch, back to three-legged dog. Left knee, left elbow, back to crunch, three-legged dog. Left knee, elbow, feeling the crunch, back to three-legged dog. <sighs> Exhale, down dog, breathe up dog. Flow into wide-legged child's pose, holding his pose, seven breaths, relaxing the body here. We're gonna hang out here for three more breaths. <sighs> 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 
maybe bringing our hands and our arms forward if they were not, rocking our bodies from side to side, walking our fingers to the front of the yoga mat, feeling a stretch here. As we wave our bodies up, doing a couple of spinal waves or finding our paws in our table pose. Whatever feels good for you. Hmm. Exhale, down dog. Holding this pose, we're gonna hold this pose three breaths. Tummy's nice and tight, noticing how our bodies feel. Ensuring that we are pushing our bodies up, away from the earth. Nice, strong arms here. We're gonna hold this pose, three more breaths. Maybe gazing back at our feet if we choose. Two more breaths, tummy's nice and tight. Ensuring that our palms are flat and nice and secure on our yoga mat. Breathe in as we exhale, standing forward fold. Noticing how our bodies feel as we completely lean forward, relaxing our bodies completely down towards the earth. Nice deep breath in. Exhale through the mouth. Completely relaxing our bodies here. Noticing how we feel in the backs of our legs and our hamstrings. Hanging out here, two more breaths. Exhale into our ragdoll, touching our shoulders from side to side. Hanging out here, three breaths. Exhale, down dog. Breathing up to our fingertips. Backs come slightly up. Chin looks slightly forward. Noticing how this feels in our bodies. Exhale, down dog. I'm sorry, exhale, complete forward fold. Half forward fold, hands are beneath our knees. Back is straight, slightly gazing forward, noticing how this feels. Tummy is nice and tight. We're gonna hold this two breaths. Exhale, complete forward fold. Exhale, half fold. Breathing up to our Tadasana. Palms are at our side. Breathe up, standing salute, palms above the head. Maybe bringing our palms together. Exhale, standing prayer. Breathe up, standing salute. Exhale, standing prayer. Breathing down, chair pulls. Noticing how this feels in our quads, in our gluteus maximus. Maybe bringing our palms forward. We're gonna hold this two more breaths. Bringing our palms back together. Palms inward towards our chest. Prayer hands. Continuing in our chair pose, we're gonna do a twist, twisting our bodies towards the left. Chair pose twist. We're gonna hang out here for three breaths. Exhale into center. Chair pose twist, opposite side. Exhale, center. Breathe down, complete forward fold. Relaxing our hamstrings here, noticing how this feels. Exhaling up to our fingertips, slightly gazing forward. Tummy's nice and tight. Breathe, complete forward fold. Exhale, half forward fold. Hands are beneath the knees. As we flow into our Tadasana, palms at our side, palms facing forward. Maybe we can pedal our feet left and right, noticing how this feels within our bodies. Breathe up, standing salute, palms above the head, finding our legs at still. 
Exhale, standing crescent moon, right side. Body leans to the right. Tummy's nice and tight. Exhale, back to center. Crescent moon, opposite side. Back to center. Palms above the head. Standing prayer. Back down, chair pose. Holding this pose for breaths. Feeling our body's breath in here. Working our quads. Working our gluteus maximus. Nice natural breaths. Exhale, complete forward fold. Walking our bodies forward to our down dog. Three-legged dog, right side, right legs in the air, nice and high. Feeling our body strength and balance here. Gazing back at our left foot. Breathe. Right foot to right hand. We are in our runner's lunge, holding this pose. Noticing how we feel. Exhale, pyramid. Right leg goes straight. Leaning forward over that right leg, extended stretch. Hanging out here for four breaths. Coming up to our fingertips, slightly gazing forward, back is getting straight. Noticing how this feels. Bending our front leg back into our runner's lunge. Relaxing our bodies. Exhale, down dog. Three-legged dog, opposite side. Left legs in the air, nice and high. Left foot, left hand, runner's lunge, opposite side. Noticing how we feel. <sighs> Exhale, pyramid, straightening out that front leg. Breathing over, extended front stretch, hanging out here, four breaths. Coming up on our fingertips, slightly gazing forward, back comes slightly straight. Bending that front knee, coming to our runner's lunge, hanging out here. Exhale, down dog. Gazing forward at our hands as we flow our bodies up, dog. Slight back bend, building strength in our arms. Exhale, back down, dog. Three-legged dog, right side. Legs in the air. Exhale, right hand, right foot. Connect, runner's lunge, flowing our bodies to our warrior two. Hanging out here, building strength. Exhale, warrior one, or high lunge, whatever feels good for you. Hanging out, back to warrior two. Reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side angle. Breathing forward, runner's lunge, down to our knees. Walking our right foot towards the edge of our yoga mat. Bringing our right arm inside of our leg. We're going to prep our bodies for our lizard. Allowing our hands to come down to our forearms. We are in our lizard pose. Our lizard pose prepares our minds and bodies for, for a split. We're going to hang out here for five breaths. We can be on our knee in our lizard or we can come off of our knee. Whatever feels best for us. Five natural breaths. Two more breaths. Noticing how we feel. Coming up on our hands. Breathing, exhale, down dog. Three-legged dog, opposite side, left legs high. Left foot, left hand, run his lunge. Breathe, warrior two. Hanging out here, building strength. Exhale, warrior one or high lunge. 
Breathing back to warrior two. Exhale, reverse warrior. Breathe forward, extended side angle. Flowing our bodies forward, runner's lunge. Hanging out here, noticing how we feel. Walking our left foot to the edge of our yoga mat. Bringing our left arm inward. Preparing our bodies for a lizard pose opposite side. Drop to our knee if we choose. Coming down to our forearms. Noticing how we feel. Prepping our bodies for split. Coming up off of our knee if we choose. We're gonna hang out here five natural breaths. Two more breaths. We're doing great. Building strength. Exhale, coming off of our forearms, coming up on our hands. Breathe. Exhale, down dog. <sighs> Gazing back at our feet. Gazing forward at our hands. Pushing forward, up dog. Feeling the strength here. <sighs> Exhale, the cobra coming down slightly. Our shoulders are away from our ears. Exhale, complete forward fold. We're gonna, I'm sorry, exhale, down dog. <sighs> exhale, child's pose. We're gonna hang out here for a couple breaths. Allowing our bodies to rock from left to right. Positioning our torsos between our thighs. Hands are forward as our bodies and torso comes downward. Maybe touching and connecting to the earth. Walking our fingertips here, feeling a full body stretch. Gazing forward. Breathing as we do a couple of spinal waves. <sighs> Or we can find ourselves in tabletop and hang out here if we choose. Whatever feels good for us. And our table, dropping our bodies down to our cow. Noticing how this feels in our spinal cord. Exhale to cat. Coming back to table, crossing our feet behind us as we find ourselves in a seated pose. Maybe in a lotus, half lotus. Notice how this feels. Exhale through the mouth. Maybe we can straighten our legs in front of us, finding ourselves in our staff pose. Oh, tummy's nice and tight, shoulders are nice and tall. Spinal cord is nice and long. Lifting our left leg up. Left foot is flat on the floor. Lifting our left arm up in the air. Leaning to the right. Now leaning forward and wrapping our arm around our left knee. We're gonna work on a Sage Marici here. Allowing our right arm to come behind our backs and our fingers will interlace behind our backs. We're gonna hang out here for a couple breaths. Feeling the stretch, feeling the twist. Noticing how our bodies feel. Completely relaxing here. Nice natural breaths. Gazing downward or closing our eyes. Exhale as we uninterlace our fingers, unwrapping that leg. Straightening out that front leg back into our staff pose. Complete forward fold. Reaching downward towards our feet or ankles. Hanging out here, three to four natural breaths. Exhale. 
half forward fold, coming back up to our staff. Lifting our right foot, right leg up, right foot's flat on the floor, knees in the air. Right arms up high, leaning to the left, leaning forward, wrapping that right arm around that left, wrapping that right arm around that right knee. We are in a Sage Marici opposite side. Fingers will interlace behind our backs. Chest comes up, feeling the stretch, feeling the twist. We're gonna hang out here for a couple natural breaths. Relaxing our minds, relaxing our bodies. Noticing how this pose feels within our bodies. Four more natural breaths. Exhale, uninterlacing the fingers, unwrapping the leg, finding our bodies back in our staff pose. Breathe down, complete forward fold. Hanging out here. Exhale back to our staff. Flowing our bodies onto our backs, hugging our knees in towards our chest. Breathe in. Exhale, recline, spinal twist, left side. Our knees fall towards the left. Our right arm comes out to the side like a T. Slightly gazing over that right arm, noticing how this feels within our bodies. Our shoulders and our backs or nice and relaxed, maybe melting backwards into the mat. Feeling our bodies go inward here. Our shoulders and spine are becoming one with the mat. We're gonna hang out here for four natural breaths. Exhale back to center, knees to chest, hugging knees into chest, noticing how this feels, maybe rocking our bodies from left to right, feeling how our spinal cord is being conditioned by the floor, finding pause, recline spinal twist opposite side, knees falls towards the right, left arm goes out towards the side, gazing over that left arm. We're gonna hold this pose for a couple breaths, ensuring that we are relaxed in our minds and our bodies. Our shoulder blades are nice and relaxed back into the mat. We're gonna hold this for four more breaths. Exhaling back to center, knees to chest, hugging our knees and to our chest. Legs come up in the air nice and high. Notice how this feels. We are in the legs on a wall pose, or in our case, invisible wall. Notice how this feels. Inhale. Exhale. Reclined, wide leg is split, allowing our legs to fall towards the side, using our hands to bring our legs even further towards the side, noticing how this feels. We're gonna hang out here for seven breaths, relaxing our bodies, relaxing our minds, allowing our legs to fall as much as they comfortably can. Nice natural breaths. Bringing our palms to the outsides of our legs. Bringing our legs together. Back to legs on the wall. Inhale. Exhale our hands down to our lower legs behind our legs. Allowing our legs to come towards our torso. Feeling the stretch. We're going to hang out here in our stretch pose for five breaths. Exhaling, legs in the air, bringing our knees back into our chest, relaxing our bodies, allowing our knees and our, allowing our legs to fall flat towards the floor. Our feet are flat on the floor, shall I say. We're going to work on a bridge pose here. 
allowing our feet to push our buttocks up in the air. Noticing how this feels. Relaxing back down. Once again, in our bridge pose, our feet pushes our buttocks and hips up in the air nice and high. We are working on our gluteus maximus here. We're going to hang out here for a couple breaths, noticing how this feels. Maybe doing a couple of pulses if we choose, working at gluteus maximus. And we can go deeper in our bridge pose by bringing our hands and arms beneath our bodies, interlacing our hands underneath our buttocks, and walking our shoulder blades towards our spinal cord, noticing how our hips and chest comes higher in the air. Maybe we can hold this pose for five breaths. Working on our gluteus maximus here, buns of steel. Two more breaths. Exhale downward, releasing our bodies, bringing our knees back towards our chest, hugging them in, legs up in the air. Reaching down to our lower legs, bringing our legs towards our torso, feeling the body stretch here. Hanging out here for a couple breaths. Exhale back to legs on the wall, bringing our knees back in. Hanging out here, hugging our knees into our chest. Three breaths. Exhale, bringing our knees slightly apart, arms in between our thighs, working on our happy baby. Feet comes up in the air nice and high. Happy baby pose. Maybe reaching down, touching our feet. Maybe rocking from left to right once again. Relaxing and conditioning our spinal cord with the earth. We also can hang out here in our happy baby and still, if we choose, or we can do a couple of leg pulses one at a time. Noticing how this feels in our hamstrings and upper thighs. We also can go deeper into this pose and go into a shoulder press pose. We're gonna play with our happy baby in any way that feels good for us for the next seven breaths. <sighs> Freestyling our happy baby. Five more breaths. Two more natural breaths. Maybe we can take a nice deep breath in here in our happy baby. Hold the breath. Exhale through the mouth. Relaxing our shoulders downward, backwards into the yoga mat. Noticing how we feel. Allowing our hands to come inward, legs come back together. We are back in our legs on the wall pose. Reaching down to our lower legs, bringing our legs towards our torso. Feeling a stretch here. We're gonna hang out here for a couple breaths. Exhale back to legs on the wall. Bringing our knees in towards our chest. Hanging out here, noticing how we feel. Crossing our legs at our ankles, pushing our bodies up to our boat pose. Legs come forward, hands come parallel to our lower legs, knowing how we feel. <sighs> Feeling our bodies balance. Our abdominal muscles are nice and tight. We're gonna hang out here for a couple breaths, building strength, working on our abdominal muscles. Keeping our legs up in the air, we're going to go into a boat pose variation. 
by reaching down and connecting our feet with our hands. Some people call this boat um, bear pose. Some people call this boat pose variation. Tummy's nice and tight, build and balance. As we allow our left leg to come out towards the side, noticing how this feels. If all is well, we'll allow our right foot to come out towards the side. Feeling a stretch here in our hamstrings. Build and balance, tummy's nice and tight. If all is well, maybe we can allow our legs to come further apart as much as we comfortably can as we keep our balance. We're gonna hang out here for five natural breaths. Breathing our knees in, our legs in. Bottoms of our feet are together. Exhaling down to our butterfly. Chest comes forward, spinal cord is nice and long. Shoulders are nice and straight. Nice natural breath. Gazing downward towards the earth. Closing our eyes if we choose. Inhale. Exhale. Relaxing the body. Maybe we can do a couple of cat cow rotations here in our butterfly by our lifting our chest up. Chin comes up. Feeling how this feels in our spinal cord. Cow. Exhaling back to our cat. Chin comes towards our clavicle, spinal cord goes out towards the back. Breathing back up to our cat. Noticing how this feels in our back. Exhale back to cow. Coming back to our cat. Nice natural breath. Exhale into our diamond. Our feet come slightly further away from our body. We are in our diamond pose. Maybe we can lean forward, forward fold. Noticing how we feel. Hanging out here for five breaths. Pushing our bodies up, exhaling back to center, we are back in our diamond. Using our hands to bring our legs and thighs together. Coming back on towards our backs, bringing our knees in towards our chest. <sighs> Hugging our knees inward. Exhaling the right foot forward. Exhaling the left foot. We are working on our Savasana here. Maybe we can grab a blankie and cover up with it. Our shoulders go backwards into the mat, completely relaxing our bodies. Our palms relax on our bodies or beside our bodies. Whatever feels good for you. Gazing downward towards the earth or closing the eyes. Inhale, exhale, filling our bodies, spinal cords, relax deeper into the yoga mat. We're going to hang out here for a couple breaths. Breathe in, breathe out. Noticing how this feels as we allow our bodies to move, as we allow our bodies to flow on our side into our fetal pose. We're gonna hang out here for a couple breaths, noticing how this feels. 
keeping our eyes closed if we choose. Maybe we can slowly rotate our ankles, moving our toes, our hips, our torso, allowing the movements to slowly awaken our body. Maybe opening our eyes if they was closed, if we choose. As we exhale to a seated pose, if we choose, we can stay in Savasana if that feels best for us. We do not have to come into a seated position. Allowing ourselves to come into a comfortable pose that feels good for us. Maybe we can bring our palms together at heart center gazing downward towards the earth or closing our eyes. Maybe we can thank ourselves for allowing ourselves to practice self-care here today. And I would like to thank you for allowing me to guide you here today. It truly was a pleasure. The light in me sees, appreciates, and respects the light in you. Namaste.